Maybe YouTube video? Maybe. I don't know. Maybe. We're all uh, shoved on the <laughs> Beautiful bed. With a very nice, very nice big king size bed. Cushiony. And we're getting ready to watch home movies from a very long time ago. Oh. But I think they're silent. Are they? Yeah, they are. But luckily we have some people here to narrate and let us people know. People who were in the video. When they were very, very young. <laughs> so it'll be... Like 50 years ago, young. Yeah, it is amazing that they have these videos. Hi, everybody. Um, I know I've introduced myself to all of you, but my name is Julia Scott. I'm a radio documentary maker and uh, also a reporter for NPR. Um, I'm just introducing myself to you as a group. Um, I'm making a, a radio documentary about Paul and his partner, Eric. And um, Paul has done me the huge, um, staggering honor of letting me into his life. Um, and let me tell his story, which I intend as a monument to him. But I want you to know that I'm doing this documentary and I just need everybody to acknowledge that um, you all know I'm a radio documentary maker. Um, so, uh, and that uh, you know that anything you may say on the record may be used here in this documentary. Does everyone understand? Yes. 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 Okay, thank you, as you were. Military <laughs> <laughs> no, back oh, yeah, I have to turn around. <laughs> what Jim sent out were all of the old home movies that he could find, and there were um, nine, no, eleven big reels, seven-inch reels that uh, had been spliced together, I guess, by by our dad, mm -hmm. uh, and then a bunch of small reels. And um, they put those on his DVDs, and the small reels are all on this last one. Um, and there were three small reels, you know, like the 25 foot reels, that they said were too moldy to transfer. So uh, I think that they had to put these together more or less in chronological order. And I'll just start off, and when you all get tired of watching, well, if you want to stop, just say stop. And when you get tired of watching, uh, we'll go to bed and we can do the rest of it later, or you can watch them after your Sorry, I said I'd be fine with all that. Can I ask you a quick question? Sure. When was the last time you guys were all in the same room together? I think this is a first. Uh, <laughs> we, were all, we were all together in yeah, November in Ann Carroll's. Well, if you're, gonna, really if you're going to include everybody in the room, this yeah. is a first. But, uh, yeah, the family had a reunion at our Ann Carroll's back in November, about a week before Thanksgiving. Oh, it included most of us. Joey and Julie weren't there, and um, Michael, Michael. And, Michael weren't there. and Carol's not here at the present yeah, time. But she'll be here tomorrow. She's coming She's coming in tomorrow. tomorrow. This is mom and dad making a cake. So this is the very first film they ever made together. And you can see they're newly, newly, newly married, and they're just so in love, and it's just so cute. I remember this one as soon as he said he had this. This looks like it could be a commercial. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I mean, it really does. It looks like it could wow. be a commercial. But actually, I had, I had that mixer for a long time. I don't know what happened to it. This has got Betty Crocker written all over yeah. it. Yeah. It's a Burnett's commercial. The dad's the one who was very much into filmmaking in the early years, so he's always the one behind the camera. Yeah, that's him right there. So you so guys, that's your grandpa. Right after I say it, oh, somebody wow. else is wow. taking the picture. Using his talents and design work to produce things for the family. But any number of things that Dad ever came up with, and he came up with many innovations, could have been marketed really? commercially. It's, it's just interesting. <laughs> this is how much. That's grandma. And I don't take a position one way or the other about what should have been done. I mean, that's just that the way grandma? it did go. That's that's yeah. our mother. Yeah. And the older woman was yeah. great grandma Eisenschmidt, yeah. which was <laughs> our grandmother's mother. Wow. Grandmother's mother. You tell, she looks a lot like grandmother. Now this grandma, isn't it? Oh, that's great grandma. That's grandma. Wow. Grandma thought Liberty 90 something. Both, both the grandmas did. The grandma. Grandpa's mom, grandpa's mom and grandma's mom. I would have been great grandma Eisenschmidt. She was born like 1878. Look at these little gardeners, they're out there watering the plants. He's drowned in them. <laughs> Dad loved his flowers. I remember that. And you know, Eric loves flowers. Yes, he does. You would get a real kick out of taking everybody through the, uh, what, what's that thing called, or Jackie? The, the, the botanical garden, I think.